Hello and welcome to the 89 rated mid icon David Beckham review. Starting off as you can see here, if you're interested anyway, David Beckham this year does have his unique free kick animation. Uh, I think he didn't have it last year because he was added halfway through the year, but they've got it here now if that sort of thing interests you. Best thing about this card is definitely is uh is passing. It is stupidly good on a game where passing is actually rather atrocious in my opinion. Obviously if you are gonna use this Beckham card, just stick him in all your set pieces because there isn't anyone better on this game. I did try him in a number of positions. Uh, firstly a right centre mid which can be useful against certain teams if you are going to use this backing card I would highly recommend you set up different formations because in my case in the games I played with him I definitely found him to be at his best in when you actually give him a lot of spaces to run into he's not so good in tight areas I don't think uh, so I would recommend playing him in a 4-2-4 at right wing He does feel a bit heavy on the ball and a 3 star combo is an ideal, more so for the weak foot, however his weak foot wasn't that much of an issue in the games I used him in, his passing was still very accurate on his left foot. Depending on where you're playing, if you're going to stick him at seat, uh, centre mid and not change his position at all. I would probably recommend a shadow or anchor, possibly an engine, but for me I put a hunter on him and he was still absolutely incredible. Price wise I gave it a 6 out of 10 because, to be honest with you, it's nothing special, it's not good value, but it's not bad value either, it is cheaper than his market price on both consoles, I just think possibly for that price you can get better. There is that player of the month Salah you could get for just a bit more. Obviously the price comes from scratch so if you have fodder in your club it does make it cheaper. There is just better options out there than this Beckham however if you do choose him he certainly isn't awful. And then overall I'll give him an 8 out of 10 for his in game performance because if he, if he can get past his slightly heavy dribbling and 3 star 3 star you've got quite the player. Hope you enjoyed the mid icon David Beckham review. Any feedback, feel free to leave it in the comments and make sure to like and subscribe for more FIFA videos.